<sighs> Welcome back. It turns out that this level did have a secret exit a after all. Anyway, let's go into the great bonus area. Is it a one-time bonus area? No? Seems we can go in as many times as we want. Of course, we gotta remember that we can only hold one power-up at a time, so... Yeah. Although, we can use the Bostro eggs to get infinite one-ups if we want. So I guess that's a benefit to this. Anyway, Rough House 1 now. Hmm. What... Interesting music here, too. Okay. Now, gotta be careful. They're footballs. They could bounce at any height. I can hear now that it seems the majority of the music in this hack is based off the same basic tune. Although, for something like that, I guess it's... I guess it's been done a bit well. Oh, I almost saved myself there. Since I don't have Bostro this time, let's just resume here. And try to find a good place to land. Okay, the, these are ninjis. We can stand on the ground for a little bit. Still not quite used to the double jump ability in this in combination with the Super Mario Bros. 3 leaf power. Okay, so... Yeah, double jump might have saved me here, but what do I do now? Really? Yeah, what now? Guess I could use Bostro for a little bit of defense, but... What would be a more effective strategy? Well, I'm standing up here already. Gotta force this guy off the screen. And land safely in the process. Okay. Um. That works. There we go, there we go. Now, if only John can keep himself safe. Alright. But since I saw two paths here, I really gotta wonder if there is a secret exit to this. Because of how linear this is, I don't really think so. Okay, but another bonus game. This brings us up to Mini Fortress 2. I wonder how I would get down here. Yes, because I see another red level, and... Hmm... I'd be confused where the secret exit to this rough house would be. Well, I'm guessing that there is no secret exit after exploration. Oh hey, right away you give us a Bostro egg. Which right away became a one-up. Kind of makes me wish I did not bring a Bostro with me. Oh well. And there's, yes, there's a John coin, not a, not a Bostro coin. At least I'm assuming that's John. John's face. Well, more of these tombstones, which would probably... I don't know. They'd probably slowly dissolve in the water, so... Okay, green flames. Interesting. Ow. And this better be a power-up right here. Yep. We're good. For a few seconds. Hey, multiple coins. Didn't think I'd see that type of block. Well, let's go up. Try to avoid the thwomp. The, the thwomp stone. Okay, okay, just a coin in that. Fine. Uh, spin jump probably could have helped. And now... I guess these are clearly originally Koopas. And yes... Okay, a shell. Well, I guess that got rid of the thwomp. I hope I didn't need it for something else. I wouldn't be surprised if this hack did have something like this, but no. We got a door. And we have... Is it gonna be Morton or is it gonna be Roy? It's gonna be Morton. Takes multiple hits, though. Five hits. Piece of cake. And down Morton goes. 
Or maybe mini. Mini fortress. Side monster. The mon the monster of side. The land of mini. I, I don't know. This land doesn't look very mini to me. Well, world 2-4. Let's enter. Alright. So what are we going to have here? A uh, note block right here. And, uh, okay. A yellow bustro egg. So we feed you blue blocks. And, um... Okay. It always looks glitchy when that happens. So what's the benefit of the yellow bustro? Well, I can already tell that the pink bustro is the same as a green Yoshi because of the egg that it comes out of. One in a question mark block. Or an envelope in this case. Let's land. We're good. Too bad the yellow bustro didn't last that long. Yeah, well, probably not gonna be too dependent on the bustros. Might need the occasional one for a secret exit, depending on how many secret exits there are on this hack. By the logic of power-ups, a green bustro is the equivalent of a red Yoshi, so that leaves the yellow and blue ones. I don't know how they would behave. Okay. Exactly what's hap what's going on here? I, I don't know. But I'm running well over much of the level. Although, you're allowing me to do it, so... I guess I'm not gonna care too much. Oh hey, another yellow bustro egg. Too bad I don't have a power-up to immediately share with it. Okay, it's not an egg. It's... Hmm. Okay, so this leads me backwards, apparently. I hope I didn't screw this up. I gotta remember that the double jump apparently resets when you land on something like an, a note block. Or anything. I guess anything that's moving. I don't know about an enemy, though. Let's try that. No, not an enemy, just an object. Well, let's take this with me. And turn it into another feather. Drat, I was hoping for a one-up. Okay. Now I guess it's time for a moment of truth once I enter that next castle. Did I break the sequence yet again? Side monster number two. Ironically, a second castle where I can test my theory. Okay, that was nice. Just run right into that tombstone. Fitting stupidity into a tombstone. John's death would be so hilarious that way. Okay. So, thank you, yellow switch blocks. You can give me a... Oh! Oh! Got one of these puzzles. Let's just be careful. How far is this gonna go? Let's wait. Let's wait. Okay, I haven't hit anything yet. Did it end, or have I hit a wall? Well, I don't have a P-switch to try- Okay, I hit a wall. Too bad I couldn't use a P-switch to make that into a bridge. Okay, let's pick up this mushroom. And spin jump on these tombstones. Take an opportunity to head above. Yes, above that saw. Okay, so... There's a green switch palace somewhere. Just don't know where I'd find it. Probably somewhere behind? I'm not sure. Maybe it had something to do with the ghost house, but I just could not get to that exit. Okay, so... Um, another Wendy. Or another side monster. To properly name this. And... I think it's exactly the same as the first one. It's probably going to be five hits just like the first. I've already hit it four times. There we go. And down it goes. Right into the molten metal. And back up to the top. <laughs> Guess it's always a good idea to put a ceiling up there, but... I digress. Um... Doggone it, I broke it again. 
Okay, now what's gonna happen? Now I'm going to head down here. A mystery doorway. What's inside this? Another area. Another world. A secret world. May Maybe not. Depends on if I can go up in this direction. Apparently I can. World 3A. And how about this direction? Yes, I can go here too. I can go to world 3-1, 3A, or 4-1. Well, I guess I'll do 3-1 next time. Mm -hmm.